Well, good day and welcome to another one of my videos. Today we're doing an I Love Lucy. I'm going to show you a blooper that not even Desi Lou caught. And it all centers around a vehicle that looks very much like this. So this will be the first you'll ever hear about it. Like always, when I give a blooper video, I kind of like you, the audience, to see if you can find it while it's happening and then show it to you after. So here is my attempt at that. Maybe the reason nobody caught this before is because it's over two different episodes. The first episode involves Lucy Misses the Mertz. The second is Country Club Dance, which is eight episodes later. As the upcoming video will tell you, the episode begins with Ricky telling Lucy that he's going to take some bags down to the car. Ethel being surprised that they have a car. She responds, car? What car? Then Lucy replies, oh, didn't we tell you? Ricky rented a station wagon to use in the country until we get settled. It is important to note the make, model, and year of the car. It's a Ford, a country squire, and since the filming of these two episodes were in 1957, we have to believe it is a 1957. Yeah, well, this place has been in such a mess for the last two weeks. I bet you'll be glad to get rid of us. Oh, Lucy, how can you be like that? We just love having you. Thank you, dear. Is this the last of it, ma'am? Yes, that's it. Thank you. Really? Honey, we'll take these two bags in the car, eh? Okay. Car? What car? Oh, did Ricky tell you we rented a station wagon to use in the country till we get settled? Station wagon, huh? Pretty snappy. Yeah, I'm gonna be a regular country square. <laughs> Honey, it's country squire. Well, whatever it is, you know, we're gonna be a real suburbanitis. <laughs> suburbanitis? He means suburbanites. Oh! <laughs> I just hope we can cross the border into Connecticut without a passport. <laughs> now let's fast forward eight episodes later in Country Club Dance. The Ricardos are invited to a country club dance by their friends the Munsons. The Ramses and the Mertzes gather at the Ricardos and the evening is off to a dull start. However, when the Munsons arrive with their house guest sexy cousin Diana Jordan in tow, the men get a second wind. The gallant trio of husbands argue each other as to who gets the first dance with Diana, while their wives look on in disbelief and dismay. In other words, they're mad. <laughs> the same crowd assembles at the Ricardos the very next evening. But the three suburban housewives think they can give Diana a run for her money. What with new hairstyles, exotic perfume, and Lucy in a very tight dress. <laughs> Ricky is concerned that Lucy can't sit in the car because Lucy's dress is so tight. She suggests that the top on the car be brought down so she can just stand. And because Mrs. Munson's perfume is so strong, Mr. Munson agrees that the top should be left down. It's a dance, so we'll be sitting. <laughs> well, you're gonna have to sit down in the car to get to the dance. Well, we'll put the top down and I can stand up all the time. <laughs> Granted, you would have to know more about cars to catch this mistake. Lucy Misses the Mertz is where the blooper sets up, but Country Club Dance is where the blooper really shows up. I'll show you how it does in a moment. Now let me go over some very important information. Lucy Misses the Mertz is episode number 170. In season 6, it's episode 17. The film date was December 20th, 1956 while the air date was February 11th, 1957. The importance here is the date of 1956. Now let me give you some important information about the episode called Country Club Dance. It is episode 178 and in season 6 it's episode 25. The film date is March 21st, 1957 while the air date is April 22nd, 1957. The reason these dates are very important is because the Ford Motor Company, which has full rights to the name Country Squire, remember the word Ricky used? Yeah, I'm going to be a regular country square. Well, in his accent anyway. <laughs> 
but Ford didn't make a Country Squire convertible until 1961. So in conclusion, there was no convertible as long as it was a Country Squire, or unless the year was 1961. <laughs> Well, okay, I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you in the next one.